So you're thinking about moving to Denver, Colorado with the family and you don't want to do, you know, the typical family stuff, you know, amusement parks, museums, stuff like that. Well, you're in luck. In this video, I'm going to talk about three places that are great family fun things to do that are a little bit out of the ordinary. So if you are having fun a mile high, let's get started. So if this is your first time to the channel, first off, I want to thank you for stopping by. Secondly, make sure you are subscribed to it so you can be notified of all things Denver, Colorado. In these videos, I talk about eating, sleeping, drinking, having fun, anything you need to know about Denver, Colorado when you're new here. My name is Tim. I moved to Denver 17-ish years ago, and since I moved here, people were calling me, texting me, emailing me all the time, asking me about what it's like to live in Denver. I got into real estate and people started asking me what it's like to move here. So I figured why not share all that knowledge. I loved helping those people and people are just like you that wanted to move a mile high. So I would love the opportunity to earn your business. Be sure to call me, text me, email me, shoot me a text, whatever works best for you. And I will make sure that you have a smooth move to altitude. So today we're going to talk about a little bit off the wall family fun stuff to do in Denver. Here are three great places to talk or to do with the family. So here is something that's really, really cool. It is a driving range that's at a lake or a pond or however you want to call this. This place is called Aqua Golf. It's right off of Santa Fe, just before you hit I-25. And sure enough, there is the driving range behind it. There is mini golf. And you can sit there and you drive your ball as long as you want into the lake. It's just kind of a cool thing. There is markers on how far you're going. If you look out far, far over there, there is a guy fishing out golf balls. Sometimes they get out of the get out of the pond and they get into these trees and stuff over here. Sometimes they actually go onto the road. But it's really cool. They have a big net that they are searching out the golf balls with in that boat over there and they just pick them up and they bring them all back in and they hit them again. I will be sure to make sure I mention it to my niece Grace, but there is the Denver Selfie Museum. The Denver Selfie Museum is on the 16th Street Mall. It's just what it sounds like. It's not your typical museum. You go in and you take the selfie yourself. There is all sorts of backgrounds. There's all sorts of you know, statues, and they're just, it's just a fun place to hang out with your family, the Denver Self Museum on the 16th Street Mall. So my daughter is four and she wants to be a chef and she's, you know, not that bad about it. Well, some of the fun things we do is we enroll her in cooking classes and it's not, you know, you're running the mill cooking class or, you know, just fun for kids. There is one, I think it's called Class Pop, that we are looking into for it. And she's, you know, they teach you how to make pastry and pasta and chocolate. And, you know, it's kind of just depending on what you're in the mood for and what you would like to learn how to make as a kid. It's just kind of a cool place to do. And it's not terribly expensive. It's just, it's great for the whole family to do. So it's no surprise at all, Denver has all sorts of hiking and biking trails. One of the coolest ones, I think, is the Cherry Creek Trail from like Confluence Park. You can ride it all the way through like the heart of downtown, or you can go the other way and go south to like the Glendale area. I don't know, it's just, it's not a hard ride by any means. It's all paved. You kind of go along the Cherry Creek, uh, Creek. <laughs> And it's just, I mean, it's an easy, fun ride. Uh, there is an REI on the route. There's a couple different, you know, coffee places. It's just a really cool, easy, family fun thing to do. Well, now you know all sorts of fun family things that are off the beaten path that you to do here in Denver. Like always, if you are thinking about making the move to the mile high, make sure you get a hold of me. Text me, email me, send me a smoke signal. Best yet, give me a call. I would love to help you make a smooth move to altitude. 